My name's Adam Corbley. I'm a greengrocer. I work down on Glossop Market, my local market. I've been here since I was 19, so man and boy, if you like. Whilst on the trip to my bank to pay some money in, I got chatting to a couple of cashiers, and they complained of being bloated after lunch, which I couldn't understand. I knew it was a problem, but I didn't know why. Obviously, I sell fruit and veg, I promote healthy eating, so I got in touch with a good friend of mine, Dr. Anthony Hobson, who's a scientist, a specialist, an expert in this field. Adam's agreed to be my experiment this morning. I've had him eating the most highly fermentable fruit possible. He's had pears, he's had watermelon, he's had mango, all the things that are more difficult to digest. So if he's gonna bloat, they're gonna produce gases, the gases are gonna be excreted through the lungs, and we're gonna pick it up on our hydrogen breath test monitor. So it blow, 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 all the way to the end of the breath. Keep going, keep going. Excellent. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna look at the screen. Okay, so can you tell us what the scores on the doors are, Adam? I'll make that. Oh, it's an eight. Eight. So eight, you're less than 20. That means that you're absorbing all those sugars and carbohydrates normally. You're not gonna get bloated. All those things are good for your healthy diet. No problem. Anthony, thanks a lot for coming down and thanks for explaining the science behind it all. I've got the gear, you've got the know-how, we just need someone now that can make this stuff taste right and get it out there to the public. Well, it just so happens that uh, I've got a friend of mine, Michael Moore, celebrity chef, and I've been talking right. to Michael about these things, about it's all very well having healthy food and, and things, but can we make it taste great? Yeah. So I think what we should do is we should take the science, we should take the produce down to Michael and see if he can come up with something tasty for people and then we'll test it out on the public. Brilliant, yeah, let's do it. Brilliant. Let's do it. Great.